Hey guys, what's going on? It is Dog with a vlog coming to you guys with a brand new video. Excuse the ramen noodle ass head. I just got out of the shower and I need to film this video real quick before I got to get my day started. So today is a brand new video and that is a monthly pickup video. I started this segment last month. Basically, it's pretty self-explanatory. All of my clothing pickups are being summed up in one end of the month video. I didn't pick up too much stuff this month. I was picking up a lot of shoes and I will waste no time. Let's go ahead and just jump right into it. So the first piece that I picked up is this hat right here. It is of the dad hat persuasion. Dad hats are my favorite style of hats. I'm not really a fan of like the snapbacks or the flat bills. I enjoy just the classic looking dad hat. So it's this, this navy blue color right here. Um, absolutely Love it. It has just a small Nike swoosh here and some Nike branding right here. I have the black version of this, although the black one's more of a hyper, uh, like a dry fit material. This one is just a regular canvas, has the traditional, you know, strap in the back. Absolutely love it. Got it as a gift from Doggett, so shout out to her. But I definitely do think this is a really clean look, and I don't really have anything that's navy blue in my hat collection. I'm trying to kind of collect a lot of different colors, so this is a really cool color to have, and that is the first pickup. I will leave a link to all of these items, of course, down in the description, so if you are interested in picking them up, go ahead and click on those links down below. Working uh, down the body from the hat down, I picked up an upper body piece. This is a white hoodie. It is just a plain white front and back hoodie. I actually picked this up from H&M. Wasn't even planning on picking it up, was just kind of in there and saw it and was like, wow, I don't really have any plain white hoodies. Um, I don't really have any plain white or like plain light gray, you know, hoodies or anything like that. So I decided I needed a white one. I have an all black one as well. And then of course the cream colored one that you guys see me wear a lot. But this is the white one. I've been already getting a ton of wear out of this, even though I just got it a couple of days ago. I've been wearing it every day. It's just an awesome piece that you can just wear with so much stuff. And I absolutely love it. Traditional strings up here that I do tie up and a really baggy hood. Go your true size in this hoodie. It fits like any other H&M hoodie. And I absolutely, absolutely love it. The only downside is it is easy to stain. I'm a big wings guy, so like pizza and stuff. So anytime it's like I'm eating sloppy food, I gotta be careful. But it is a super clean look and it goes with a ton of stuff. And it'll look really good in the fall with some layered pieces. Moving right along to the lower uh, body is a pair of pants that I got. These are the men's thought pants of 2017. The H&M uh, twill khaki zipper pants and let me just start by saying I fucking love these. You guys remember how much I love the black pair from that I got in September or most of October. I like this pair more. I like this color a lot more and I definitely will be going to get the olive green pair at some point point two because I absolutely fucking love the shit out of these pants. I did have to do my true size a 32 as opposed to a 30 which I did in the black ones and I actually like it better. The legs have a much better tapered look with my black ones because they are a size smaller than what I normally wear. Um, the bottom or like the leg, it kind of looks like leggings from a distance. So it looks like I'm walking around in leggings. With these, it is much, there's much more room down here. You can tell it is just a pair of khaki pants that's stacked really nicely. And there is kind of some drop crop, drop crotch action, which I'm not a big fan of, but H&M puts it on pretty much all of their pants that aren't jeans. Um, I am kind of just dealing with it. It's not terrible. It's not as bad of a drop crotch as some of the pants that I've gotten from them, but I do absolutely love these. I love the zipper pants. If you guys don't have a pair of zipper pants, of course I'll link these down in the description and check your local H&M if you haven't already because they probably do have them. I know they have an olive green pair as well and a black pair with like some cargo pockets, so I might end up going to pick those up. But this is an awesome, like, really inexpensive alternative alternative to some of, like, the, you know, I Love Uglies SB Pants or some of the more expensive brands. This is a really, really nice, inexpensive alternative that, in my opinion, looks, you know, just as good. So definitely pick these up. Link is in the description. The last piece that I picked up isn't really a piece of clothing, but it's more an accessory, and it is actually this watch right here. Now, this is just a silver fossil watch. As you can see, it's got the face with two hands. This one won't stop spinning. Um, and then this one right here. So um, I absolutely love this. It's in a silver just with a linked band. It is from Fossil. I received this from Doggett for a, as a birthday present. It was my birthday in October. I just turned 20. So she bought me this as a gift and it's totally awesome. She has a little personal message ingrained in here. She did get this online, so I will link it down below as well. Fossil has some really cool watches. I'm sure as a lot of you guys know, I was wearing my gold 
Nixon, uh, the Canon, I believe it's called. I was wearing this for a really long time and I do still love this watch, but I just wanted something that was a little more grown up, a little nicer looking, and so this silver watch is really awesome with the black face. So if you are looking for a watch, I will leave a link down below to the fossil doc to fossil.com. They have a ton of really, really dope uh, watches, you know, wallets, uh, bags, backpacks, and stuff like that. So I'll leave a link to all that stuff down below. Not too many crazy pickups or stuff that I picked up. It was a pretty slow month. Like I said, I was buying a bunch of shoes, but um, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Let me know what your favorite piece that I picked up is, and then let me know what you guys picked up for this month and kind of what you're wearing and stuff. But other than that, it is Dog with a Vlog, and make sure you keep it locked on the channel and check out the vlogs and sneaker reviews that I have upcoming, and I will talk to you guys super, super soon. Peace.